Now let's deliver these resolutions. Let's see, the first of these is to Torku in the southeast part of the sixth circle. I think I'm in the sixth circle. This place can get so confusing you can't be too sure at times. Let's see. Where could... this be? Alright. Ah, the house is appealing. Yeah, I think this is where I need to go. Hello there. As you know, I am the warden of the Houses of Healing. That was very fast, Pineleaf. Perhaps you should become an errand writer for the city. I suppose it will be difficult for you to leave the adventuring life behind, but prompt delivery of messages is something to be prized, and you seem to be skilled at it. As you know, I am the Warden of the Houses of Healing. At the council meeting that was just concluded, I requested an increase in supplies and goods for the use of my healers, the spare cloths, water for boiling, warm blankets. The council agreed with the principle of my request, uh, but not to its whole extent. I have been granted an increase, but a small one. It is better than no increase at all, I suppose. We will take blankets and clothes from evacuated houses, for their owners have no current need of them, and I will arrange with the Warden of the Wells to provide me with spare buckets. Alright. So, we need someone hip in. Second circle in the Citadel Fitz Circle. That means back... Oh, wait a Actually, if my map is right... We can get to the Fitz Circle down here. Alright, let's see... Where are we... going? Black house, let's see. We want let's see Murindel in the southeast section. That will be somewhere this is southeast, isn't it? No, this is southwest. Ah, see I well, what they need is to find someone better than a direction-challenged hobbit to deliver their messages. Especially one who doesn't know their city. And have no trouble finding places in the Shire. Alright, now, where were we? Alright, we need... The Archivist. Hello there. I am the Warden of the Stores. It is a difficult responsibility. Ah, the Council Resolutions are already written? Well, that was fast. It is good to see such haste, but it usually takes much longer for the orders of the Council to be put into action. Everyone is worried about what lies ahead, and it spurs them to move with haste. I am the Warden of the Stores which means that all of the food and goods brought into the city fall within the scope of my duty. I find where they can be stored safely and free from theft or spoilage, and assure that the folk who need access to them have it. I must confess some trepidation to you, Pineleaf. If the city is besieged, I will surely it will surely become the most hated man in Minas Tirith. Oh yes, I guess you will. The man who rations the food is never loved by the hungry. 
This resolution will allow me to conduct a full inventory of the stores, so I will know how much food and other supplies we will have at our disposal. If the gates are sealed by war, that inventory may become very important indeed. Hmm. Interesting. Now, what else have we got on here? Now, if I remember, Pippin said something about the Thirsty Seer in the southwest section. Let's... Southwest section of the city. Where is Southwest and somewhere up here? Yeah, I might have been able to. Maybe I should have come this way first. Well, I guess the resolutions are more important. Now, where is this thirsty seer? Actually, I don't think we want to get in their way. Right now. Well, I don't think a uh, seer would be very thirsty in this place. No, I think not. Alright, let's see. Alrighty, I think it'd be somewhere around here. at all. Let's see if I can figure this out. Tiffin wasn't very specific, was he? Oh. I just go full. I went way past. Well, I wasn't expecting that. Well, Alright. See, I am lost already? Hey! Oh. So, I'm in the north part! Oh. One directionally challenged hobbit. That's all that lies between us and the destruction of Gondor. Well, I hope that's not all that lies between them and the destruction of Gondor, or Gondor is in a lot of trouble. Now, where were we? All I have to do is... You know, you would think that a hop would have no trouble finding lunch, right? You'd think, if anything, I would have no trouble finding it would be lunch. Alright, now here's... Oh, hang on. Well, picnic clutch. All right. Uh, to the watch point at the end of the pier, at the top of the city. Uh, I'm sure the guards will really love me carrying this along, won't they? Hello, why are you carrying that picnic basket? Uh, that's a surprise we're not already under rationing. Alright. Let's heat up here. Okay, that is there. So I need to head up this way. Find Pippin. Well, actually, first I need to find the ramp. Ah, here we go. One ramp up to the citadel.
Oh, yes. I forgot about this ramp. That it goes in circles. Or squares. Or rec... Whatever. Alright, now. Pippin. Why is he wanting to go way down here? I presume this is what he means by the end of the pier. We will find out. Certainly has a good view of what's going on. If there were anything good to look at other than bunches of orcs and lightning and red clouds. Mordor, I mean, Mordor isn't exactly the best thing to look at. Alright, well, that all looks nice. Yeah. Not the prettiest sight in the world. Hello, Pippin! Do not be shy, my friend. Let us dig in. Ah, look at this delicious bread pine leaf. I see why Gandalf spoke so highly of the Thirsty Seer. It is his favorite tavern in Minas Tirith, apparently, and I can see why. Well, do not be shy, my friend. Let us dig in, and we can talk after we have taken in the edges of our appetite. Alright, I suppose so. Alright, we can have a nice little meal here. Yeah, that sound, that was nice. Ah, most refreshing after all this I've been doing. Running up and down ramps. Going all over the city. Ah, that was nice. Why did we come here? Well, Gandalf for... Well, you see... Uh, uh... Well, uh, that's a good start, but by no means an end. I will nibble a bit while we speak, if that is all right with you. Okay, and how did you get to this city? Oh, Gandalf brought me here. I slipped much of the way, but Shadowfax is the swiftest of his kind, and he was at a gallop for most of the journey. Why did we leave our friends behind? Well, Gandalf thought he... He just thought I should see Minas Tirith is all. Uh, the others had their own plans, and, you know, he, he, he's a wizard. Yes, y yes, he's a wizard. Yeah. Sounds rather evasive for Pippin. Oh well. Let's have a little something to eat. Maybe he'll be ready to say a little bit more later. Right, a little bit more there. Ooh, yeah, you have something else to say? I wasn't entirely honest with you, uh, and I, I'm sorry for it. Yeah, Gandalf did not bring me to Minas Tirith without cause, or a simple sightseeing, yeah. I know you were not deceived, but it is difficult to speak of, and, and I'm ashamed that I might have uh, worked some harm. <laughs> uh, not on purpose, see! Uh, Gandalf called me a fool once or twice, or he was right to do so, but I would never endanger my friends on purpose. See, there is this artifact in Isengard. Wormtongue threw it down from the tower, intending to do some harm to either Saruman or Gandalf, and I saved it from rolling away into a pool. Gandalf claimed it soon afterwards, but not soon enough. I found I could not stop thinking about the dark globe. I, 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 uh, I stole it away from the wizard when he slept, and I looked at it, finally. I, I saw, I, I saw... Uh, oh. What, lightning storms? You saw lightning storms? I saw a tall tower and a black sky and wheeling shapes. Wheeling shapes like 
bats, but much larger and more fright. Oh yeah, I know what you mean. <laughs> and then I saw, I saw him, Pine Leaf. He looked at me, and his voice came not to my ears, but to my mind. If that makes any sense, he asked me questions, and when I did not answer, I felt searing pain. I told him I was a hobbit, and his laughter was cruel. He said I would see him soon, and then Gandalf broke the spell and took me away f from the stone. The artifact was a seeing stone. A palantir uh, and Saruman had used it to communicate with, with his dark master. Gandalf would not tell me very much about the stone. But he seemed to think we escaped a much worse fate through a lucky chance of good fortune. I think he was right. I could not turn my eyes from the stone, and if that horrible figure had continued his questions, I know I would have answered him. What else might he have shown me in the Palantir? I cannot guess. And I don't wish to do so. This is not the sort of conversation that's good with picnics, Pine Leaf. Let us clean up our food, and we can speak of it again at my post. All right. Here we go. All right. Well. Let's head back to the post and see about, I guess, well, I don't know when it is lunchtime in this place. It's always dark. And believe me, it's too dark for lunchtime. Much too dark for lunchtime. <sighs> Gondor. Sure, it looks much better when there isn't a mile of ash over your head. Alright, now where were we? Hey, hello Pippin. There may once have been good reasons for using such stones, but no longer. I would like to apologize for spoiling our picnic with such frightening conversation, Pine Leaf. And the food was delicious, and the company was excellent, of course, but... I should not have spoken too much about seeing stones and what I saw within it. Well, don't worry. I'm just glad to see everything's alright. Well, I thank you for saying so, my friend. I will give such artifacts a wide berth from now on. I can assure you of that. There may have once been a good reason for using them, as Gandalf says. But now that there's so much trouble in... Well, you know what land I mean. Now that there's so much trouble away in the east, I dare say no one should peek into those stones. Ever. I will get back to my duties now, Pine Leaf. It was nice to see you again. Yes, and nice to see you again, Pip. Now I guess I gotta go and finish delivering those resolutions. Thank you everyone for watching this episode of Pine Leaf in Gondor, where we explore this ancient kingdom of Middle-earth. And this is Pine Leaf Needles reminding you to quest responsibly.